So we're having a great day today. It is Valentine's Day. Happy late Valentine's Day to you. You know that I film a week later. Some of you guys are new, so I know somebody asked, I'm confused. Why is it this day and this day? So I explained in the comments that when we lived in the mountains, I tried, when I started vlogging, I tried doing it, filming one day, and then uploading it like that within that next day and getting it up. And then sometimes our internet works, sometimes it didn't. Then it just completely stopped working. We had no mountain internet. If you live in the mountains, you see cell phone towers, you still have no signal, no signal. I never understood that. We were one of the regions in Western North Carolina that had the least reception ever. <laughs> so what are you gonna do? So I started filming like on a Monday and then I was able to go somewhere and I was able to upload all of my videos for the week in about one to two hours. It was so wonderful. It took the stress off of like, okay, trying to get everything up because that is a stressful thing. And then it also worked out because when we were gone, we lived in an isolated mountain. I was home a lot by myself and so for someone to know like, hey, you're gone on vacation, your house is left by itself. No, it's just safety, it's smart to do. And then we moved to Florida here. I got the best internet in the world. My videos upload in like minutes, most of the time. So love it, but I'm like, you know what? It's just easier to keep that same pattern going. So that means my holiday videos are a week behind. I'm not, I don't pre-make a Valentine dinner. What do I make a Valentine dinner? I don't pre-make a Christmas dinner or pre-make a Thanksgiving because I just film more my days. I Sometimes we do things extra, but for the most part, I'm not just making a video to make a video. Does that make sense? It's like, I'm not, I guess I'm not a real influencer. One that would be like, here, let me show you Christmas meals to make. I'm more like, hey, let me encourage you. And I'm here for my day. This is my life. Sometimes it's exciting. Sometimes it's not. Sometimes we do the same thing. Sometimes we eat the same things over and over. It's life. It's real. 
it's real it's real life so hopefully that explains a lot of things for some of you so today is Valentine's Day I'm off a day as well because I had an extra video this week for my birthday and so it is Madeline's birthday and so so usually sometimes Valentine's Day just gets like looked over and yeah and most of the time it does because I'm mom and I'm busy and life and everything else but this year I was like okay Maddie usually is the birthday fairy we call him that Lauren's sort of the birthday fairy way back in the day because I had lots of kids. And as a mom, you know, you decorate for the first few kids, make it all those kind of things. We did nice things, but like, it just got tiring. I was tired. I did not want to get up before the kids and decorate the house. It just didn't happen. So Lauren took over the studio's birthday fairy and she would decorate, make the house so great. I'm like, that is super sweet. And then Lauren got married, moved out, and then Jaden took on that role. And she mostly did most of it. And then um, pretty much when we were in the mountains and then we moved here and then Madeline kind of took over like, doing some things and so she said yesterday she's like i wonder who's gonna be the birthday fairy or she, she said she's like i hope the birthday fairy visits for my birthday and i was like yes the birthday fairy is gonna visit for your birthday because i have forgotten because it's one of those things i don't normally do so that's why i went and got things so love the balloons the happy birthday that was very cool i had the air compressor i was like sitting there yet when i got them i'm like i'm not gonna blow all these balloons up because you know i'm old it's a lot of work and i'm like wait a minute air compressor so we just drank the cord in greg's like i put it right here in the bedroom floor and you can just blow up the balloon so that worked out and then the letters were awesome. I was afraid it would like pop. I didn't really know for those of you that have never used this before. So I stuck the straw in there. It, there's like a little valve in there. And like for the first time, it's probably a little closed. I had to pop it a little bit. So that's what I was afraid, but I realized, oh, it just needs to be pushed through. And then you have to seal it. I didn't seal some of them. That's why I had to go back and do them. So those are up. I should have got like masking tape. I had to use the scotch tape and hopefully they stay up. I keep watching them. And then we just had the streamers, twisted the streamers, stuck those up. I started putting them on top of the, but I was thinking, where else am I going to put these things at? So I started putting them across the bar and I'm like, wait a minute, that doesn't like on the lights. And I'm like, wait, now you can't see the happy birthday, Amy. I'm a little tired. So I just took them down and did a bunch of them, stuck them on the side. I'm like, that's good to go. And then just tie the balloons together. If you use fishing line, I had fishing line from, or string, fishing line works better for, um, they had some in that package of the happy birthday and just tie the balloons together you can put clusters of balloons we used to do it at church we would decorate we would do a big happy birthday party for jesus so we would um sew like with needle we would sew fishing wire and then we do it on the string and then hang them and then we would do clusters by like sewing them real quick together and you would get a bunch of balloons together just an inexpensive way to decorate we would order i don't even know how many balloons lots of balloons and sit there and blow them up and it's just a cheap way to decorate it's a cheap way to decorate so that's what I kind of did in there a little bit. And then got everybody's little Valentine stuff out and have the treats out for everybody. And then I um, got her little snack basket together, her little stuffed animal. And then she's gonna go out shopping today. And so we're gonna go out and get the rest of her birthday stuff. We give our kids a birthday budget and then we decide, do you want to go do something? Most of the time, when they're a little, little, sometimes they want to go out and do things, but for now they go, hmm, we do those things all the time. So most of the time it's like, here's your money, what would you like to do? So hers is she's undecided, but she'd like to go shopping. And so I said, well, we'll go shopping, pick out some stores she wants and go. She really doesn't need a whole lot. She needs a few things, like she needs some shorts. Um, and so for the summer, cause it's, or for the, for the winter, because it's nice here and then, um, I think we have to buy a bathing suit, but if we see one, that's awesome. If not, we've been looking on Amazon too. So for the most part, I'm looking for shorts. That's the goal. I'm like, shorts, something she likes that's comfy. That's good. She's got t-shirts. We bought some shirts. She's got shoes. I'm like, it's good. And then whatever, whatever else she finds, she's got a lot of like facial stuff, a lot of makeup, a lot of nail stuff. And so I'm like, hmm, it'll be more of like, she sees something, maybe she'll get it. And if not, she'll save her money and she likes to play games. And so I said to her yesterday, I said, well, you can always take that money and use it for video you know your games wouldn't get a card and they said oh no no because in the mountains one time the girls had signed up on their ipads and they got from the apple store they had my card saved and i thought we deleted it well when you have mountain internet it's so bad so they would click it to buy something which they asked me well then like the internet doesn't go through it just shuts off and stops and so they had clicked it numerous times and so we had a couple hundred dollars worth of charges for apps that were you know not something that i was like yeah no that's not a good thing so live and learn i said well we can always get a card at the store today like and then you can use that card so when the card you know goes out you don't have any more stuff for your games so we'll see she said well maybe when i'm all done if i don't if i have money left over maybe i'll do that and if not maybe she'll take the cash whatever she wants to do so that's our plan for the day jaden just left she's going to go get her some flowers and she's going to get her a balloon she wanted to get her a balloon and then she said she'd be right back so she's running to pick that up for her and then she's maddie's going to get up 
and nothing really opens till about 10. So I said, no hurry, sleep in a little bit. Birthdays, no chores, no nothing. So she'll get up, have some breakfast here, and then we're gonna head out. I'm sure she's gonna wanna get a coffee because that's fun for a teenager. And then, I don't know, well, Five Below is on the list for sure, the Nike store. And I don't know what else, we'll just kind of go and see how the day is. So I figured we'd go for a while, come back, and then um, we can heat up dinner. I've got to cook pasta for spaghetti and just heat the stuff up in the oven. So it's going to be a great day. It's a great day. I've got the treats out for the kids. The other ones, we did a double school yesterday. So I said, you have the day off. Still have to do chores, <laughs> but we have the day off. And then we'll just have a great day. So we're going to bring you along whatever fun. Maddie doesn't mind being on camera. She likes being on camera. She doesn't mind the haters. She's like, you know what, Mom? They all need Jesus. <laughs> So she's the child that can just look past that and be good to go. So we're going to film and then it's going to be a great day. So you ready? All right, let's go. Oh, can we appreciate Maxine got a toy too. We cut these at the dollar store, but then we went to a Valentine party for a homeschool group and one of the moms put gift bags together for the kids. And so she gave everybody one of those little monkeys. And so I said today, I'm like, oh, she's already got a monkey. So I gave it to Maxine. So she was excited. She's not here. I think she left and went upstairs with Maddie. She likes sleeping with her. She stays sometimes with me. And then sometimes she stays with Maddie. Sometimes she shuns me and she stays with Maddie. Sometimes she shuns Maddie. Who knows? I think she's feeling a little indifferent lately. She's been a little different. And so I'm like, is it because we're not walking? What is the issue? So who knows? Just a dog. We all have them. So let me get her up. <laughs> did the birthday fairy do good? The birthday fairy did not disappoint. Okay. I was just making sure. <laughs> Happy birthday, Maddie. <laughs> hey, start out birthday. Thank right you. here, Caramel Ribbon Crunch for the birthday girl, Maddie. How old are you this year? 13. I have to ask my kids because I forget. No, I know you're 13. <laughs> <laughs> so we are out for a fun-filled day shopping, but first we have to start with Starbucks. Because you, you need that caffeine. Because you need that caffeine. I didn't get it because I'm like, I already had caffeine. And once you get a certain age, like you can only limit. You have to limit yourself with caffeine, I feel like. Delicious. Very delicious. Yeah. So where to first, Maddie? Five below. Five below. Okay. I love that. Store. She loves this store. For no reason. For no reason, because it's five below. So we're gonna go in there and see what she finds. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Okay, we're going to five below, see what we can find. I know, this was like what I would love as a kid. Now you can get things, you containers for five. So delicious. Look at little best salts right here. We don't really do best. Sour Patch Kids. Oh, body scrub, but look at this Jelly Rancher. They got some stuff. For those, we, we had those for church. Those are always fun to play with. So we have to keep them out because we want to get like stuff. There's so much stuff. Maddie, how much nail polish does a girl need? Look at these colors. Well, I'm running out of, is this top Just clear? Coat? Ooh, this is pretty. I'm running out of the top coat stuff. Okay. I don't know. Look at, these are three. Look at the fun color, or two for five. That French fry top. These are all, oh, containers. Oh, there's Reese's Pieces. Oh, look at Maddie. It's a Cheeto bomb. The girls call her Cheeto. Look at, oh, Maddie. It's a Cheeto, Maddie. Oh my gosh, I would buy that for you. I wonder if it tastes like cheese. Is this really a Swedish fish face mask? Is that what that is? That's so weird. I hit the jackpot for Maddie. It is a little chilly in here. I'm freezing too. Makeup. Hot sauce. And we traded. She wants the neons just for fun play. Scrub money. I need one of those. <laughs> Shavas. I need a scrub mommy. I need a scrub daddy. Look at these. We just discovered these colors. Do any of those look cute? Look at the orange one. Do you like the clear one? Because I like this one. Which one? I like the bit on this one? This one? Oh, we got some. Back in the day when Maddie was a little kid, this would have been her favorite thing to buy from. They still my favorite. <laughs> yeah, I was the same. We know your team. We were looking at cups. Everybody needs to come look at the palm tree up there. That's so fun. Can you get it? You're almost there. You should, Maddie. I'll hold the cart. I got the cart. I'm holding it. Look at that. That's a fun cup. <laughs> Somebody took it out. It's a toaster lamp. Isn't that cute? Mm -hmm. What is this? For your Barbies. No, like what are they, a cup holder or something? For your Barbies. Your Barbies, that's fun. So funny, like I remember when inflatable chairs came out, the older ones wanted inflatable chairs. They were like big, I don't even know, a long time ago for us. The coffee made me do it. Okay, they got some stuff. Dumpling squishies. Squishies used to be so much fun. Mini ukulele for $5. Minnie's like, I got this. Where was this when you were a little kid? I know. Now they're everywhere for $5. Oh my goodness, I remember Barbies. like, oh my gosh, Barbies would have loved that back in the day. Look at them all. These modern aesthetic games. Mancala, look at that in like the cool colors. That's very cool. Milkshake word scramble. They got some stuff. 
All right, Maddie's loving her life because you know what? It's self checkout. <laughs> so she's checking it all out. We got some stuff. Do your groceries. She's for hire. <laughs> okay, we got some cute stuff. We, we went down every aisle and I said, don't don't even think twice, just put it in the cart. <laughs> she did good. You got your stuff, you like it? Girls are gonna like it. Fun girl stuff. We're gonna go into Marshalls now. <gasps> Look at so We found some. Are they comfy? Mm -hmm. Okay, we're gonna get them. Let's get them. Get Maddie's this. like, Mom, you should get this coffee scrub, the best. Get this for Amy. Get this for Amy, yes. She got a shampoo scalp scrub. This is fun. I don't need it. That's beautiful. Mom only uses water. I literally use water. You guys are all in your fancy swashes. So there's more over here too if you want some. We just had a smell and we're like, it smells like grandma. It does. It's white musk. That's weird. Mm. It smells like grandma in her house. It smells like grandma's we house. Get it. I know. How much is it? <laughs> it's just soap though. Wow. Four dollars. We'll come into Marshalls and smell her. You got yourself one of those, don't you? You have a Michael Kors purse. <laughs> She's got herself a Michael Kors purse already. Her daddy bought it. <laughs> Look at the blue apron. That's so cute. The G one. Mama needs another apron like she needs another seashell. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> I already have like so only. many. It's only ten dollars. No, I'm good. <laughs> Here, Maddie's trying on fun clothes, just picking out cute dresses, all grown up, all fun. So I said, let's just pick out a few things, look at them, and see how they look. So let's see how she she looks. Trying on one dress, but the top was uh, not super tight. I don't, we're the only ones in here, so top was a little loose and the shoulders kept falling down, but it was very pretty purple. Very purpley, very cute. So she's going for a dress number two, let's see. Okay, number two, a little loose on the top too. So we're gonna see, we're gonna, we, the other option is get like a spaghetti strap and stick it underneath there. So we'll see, see if she loves them. Okay, it is a great day today, isn't it? It is a great day. Okay, no clothes, but that's okay. We tried on a few dresses, they're cute. They're a little looser on top and they're like low cut. So I told her like the whole look of like a spaghetti strap tank top a cami underneath but they didn't have any they all they had were these like high neck things so she couldn't really visualize it so I said you know what we'll find one somewhere so all right we're gonna go ahead to Nike Nike she needs she likes Nike shorts and I believe Nike shorts are on sale we oh, think yes. so we'll go get the shorts let's go we're gonna see if we can find some shorts okay she got shorts cute look at these ones cute shorts all right we got two pairs of shorts yay there's a girl in her Nike she's good <laughs> she's got her Nike <laughs> we got some shorts now we're gonna go get some lunch. She's hungry. I was thinking she wants to go to Panera. I was just thinking there's one that was way far away, but I didn't realize there's one that's a little bit closer. So we're gonna go to Panera for red for her lunch. So we're going to Panera. So we, uh, I ordered, I, thought, I tried to order online because I was like, we still got a half hour drive. I'm like, let's get smart and order. But it didn't like say, place your order. Like wouldn't, it would kind of freeze. It doesn't like give me a chance to pay for it, but it says it's ready in 10 minutes. So it's free for us. it must just be free today unless it checked it out three times in my card because I clicked refresh three times. We'll see. So we're going to go into Panera and eat lunch. All right, Maddie got herself some breakfast cheddar and signature chicken, a smoothie. And then it was my birthday. So they had a reward for my birthday, but I said it's actually her birthday. So we got her the cookie. I got a bacon avocado look at and some broccoli cheddar soup delicious the best, the best. best. panera is the best Wow, I got the first notification they're like traffic is lighter than usual it never happens here in Florida mm -hmm. <laughs> How was lunch? It was really good. Did you feel it was good? You're yeah, well. Good. You were disappointed with your sandwich. The sandwich wasn't. We ordered the, the chicken. Best, what was it? But it was original fine. sandwich. It was okay. Just not. You're used to other ones that you like better. So that's okay. Mm -hmm. But the soup was delicious, right? Yeah. Soup was delicious, and she's full. So we're gonna go ahead to Walmart. She's got a gift card from Miss Carol. Thank Send you, Miss Carol. Thank you, Miss Carol. So she's gonna go buy some things at Walmart. Look over there. It says, "It's the Barbie car." That's so funny. <laughs> Someone's got a lot of money to be able to do that. <laughs> Marco Robbie's in the Barbie car. It said traffic is lighter than usual. Does it look like it's lighter than usual? <laughs> Google scamming us. Yeah. Ready, got food in us. Ready to go for second round. We're gonna go to Walmart here, and then she said he wants to go to Target. So we're not too far from Target, too. It's probably like 85 degrees on your birthday, Maddie. Yeah. You want snow? Yeah. Maddie wants some snow. You had snow last year. Yeah. <laughs> you got snow. Uh, Let, we didn't have snow on. No, you did. We were in Michigan, so you got snow. We didn't have snow. But you didn't have snow on your birthday, though. You get it like a week before. This year we're in sunshine, so let's go into Walmart and get our things we are going to pick up. I just showed Maddie the fun blankets. I'm like, I just saw those. Are those cute? Mm -hmm. Your bed? She mentioned candles. So we're going to find $25. We'll go down. Look at it, like $10. Oh, 
oh, look at this, $12 for a candle? Oh, Goose Creek. Right here, Walmart, $4. <laughs> Walmart brand's always cheaper. This, I think, is the best smell. Do you see watermelon? Smell it. Oh, mommy loves that. Oh, look at crispy treats. What is that, Rice crispy? Ooh, ooh. What is that? What is that? Pound cake. I like my ice cream. Yummy, this smells like Rice crispy treats. The pound cake's delicious. So many, I can't even, I'm like smelling these all. Oh yeah. Mm. I don't know about that one. There's so many good flavors. I have so many still from Christmas. I keep, oh, apple. Apple's like a great smell too. Smell that one. I like apple. It's very strong. Okay, purple. Blackberry. I wonder if blackberry's good down there. The purple one all the way to the right. Fruity ones. Ooh. Ooh, that's good. Grapey. These ones are only $4 as well. Oh, look at Florida Day. What's Florida Day smell like? Oh, float all day. I said Florida Day. Mm, coffee? Mm -mm. I thought I said, oh, try this one. Float all day, selling it one hand. What does float all day mean? Mm, not really. Could be better. Could be better, okay. I think she got looking for a nail polish remover. Oh, unless she sees something up there. Right there. <laughs> I feel like every teenager stops in this section probably. probably. To the right is the soft scrub still, this sand scrub stuff. Nail polish remover, a dollar. She needs that. And she got some tape. And she picked out some diamond art succulents. In her jacket. What's that? Okay, we're going to the teen section. Here we go. Maddie, you should get the fluffy blue sweater. Ooh, green. Oh, that's cute. You should have that. That's very pretty. That looks really cute. Don't look like how it's the length. Well, it's cute though. Everybody needs flamingo pants. The outlets did not work out, but she got some things that she needed. So she wanted some nail polish, some tape, a wonderful ice pound cake candle, diamond art, and she wanted to get a couple of new pillowcases. So this was her $25 and then some, I think I'm gonna get these. And then um, I needed some Gorilla Tape for my camera. I bought muffs for the top so that the um, wind doesn't blow on it. And then the volume was so low, I took it off thinking, oh, I have another one at home. Well, I don't have any tape, but I have all the muffs. So I'm hoping, this says bonds to material fabric so I'm hoping that works and I don't spend five dollars on waste that because they're only like eight dollars for the ones on Amazon so I'm gonna be hopeful but well, maybe there's a money back guarantee you never know so we're gonna go ahead I think she's um, trying on she got some pants and a dress it was a little too a little too see-through and then she isn't sure she likes the pants so we're just gonna get these and then go ahead to Target I think and go look there okay Walmart done how do you feel after Walmart pretty good good you got the things you want to get Mm -hmm. Okay, now we're gonna. Go, we actually found a pair of shorts for um, bathing suits, like a black pair to put over it. Not a bathing suit, but we'll keep looking for a bathing suit on Amazon. So we um, we saw, found a pair of black shorts. That's always difficult to find too. So we're gonna go ahead and Target. Okay, maybe it's Target. We're gonna go get. Oh, there's a crow. Maddie like opened the door. She stopped. I'm like, what? There's a crow over here looking for some food. He's looking for food. There he is. She's going. She's going to the beauty section first. <laughs> Oh, look at secret. Maddie's gonna get, you gotta get some nail polish. I have nail polish. These are in clearance, look at $3 for pretzel bites. These are pretty good, that's a good deal. She's getting this in her hair. She wants to brighten and tone herself. I mean, Joe Wash. That's funny, we used to use this stuff on the kids when they were babies. It used to be like $10 a bottle, still about $11. So that's not bad, this is really good. You want some pure soap right here. <laughs> this is pure soap, no bubbles. Just does a good job. We use this on our babies. I actually used it for a dish soap too. <laughs> Compared to like, look at this, $24. Well, like why? Because why you somebody will pay it. <laughs> That's why. That's Traded for a lighter one. I can realize the net polish is all covered up in prices and it was like $10 for the one she picked out. This one was five, but then I looked under here, there was a clearance. So we found a clearance one, pretty much the same for $2.24. Perfect. All right, successful trip. We got stuff for her snack closet and a bunch of other girly fun stuff. So we're gonna go ahead. Lots of traffic over here. So. Run and jump. <laughs> so good. All right, we got some stuff. Saved by Target at the last store. We were able to get the rest of the stuff. So we feel like successful. The girls have their own little snack things. So now they have her own little snacks as well. She can add her own stash to the mini fridge. You got some stuff. All right, Maddie. Successful day? Mm -hmm. Feel better now? Yeah. 
Yes, she wasn't not sure what she wanted, so we just kind of went to browse, but we found stuff all in the end, so that was good. Yeah. And then we had a nice talk about marketing and how it's ployed to spend more money. I said, look for the name brand stuff, you know, or the no name brand stuff versus the name brand stuff, because it'll get you. So now we're going to go ahead home, try to get out before the school kids get out for traffic, because then my GPS won't say, traffic is lighter, it'll say it's been backed up another hour. So we're going to go ahead home, and then we're going to heat up dinner, and I'm going to see if uh, Autumn will get it cooking for us first, and then we'll go home and have delicious birthday dinner. Great day. Yay. Happy birthday. Thank you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to whoever's birthday's on Valentine's Whoever else is. <laughs> okay, let's head home. All right, we are home now, so I've got to get dinner. I turned it on high, so that's going to be in here, and I've got, let me see here. Pasta boil in here. Um, Jane's got her kombucha over here. She made kombucha, which was awesome, so let me get a knife out. So the only thing I'm going to do is heat up this corn here, corn and corn. Very simple. We had a good day out. Fun for her birthday. She's got tons of stuff to go put away upstairs. I laughed because we came home and like a lot of those letters fell off the scene. It was like, happy Earth Day. <laughs> so I just taped them all up and like one just fell down. I was like, ah. So use masking tape next time. That'll work. You carried all your goodies up to your room? Mm -hmm. Maddie's got like a stash now. We're going to come to Maddie when we need a snack. She's going to have all kinds of snacks, which is awesome. So much fun. Let me sleep in her bed. So I'm just going to put corn here. Corn on the cob, just the frozen stuff from, I think we got it from Sam's Club, into a pot, put some water in here, a little bit of salt, let it come to a boil, and then um, everything's heating up in the oven. It shouldn't take, hopefully not too long. I just turned it on, so we'll do as fast as we can. And then I got a birthday gift from Miss Barbara, too. She sent a bunch of fun socks that say, what does it say? Life is better at the beach. So cute. So everybody's got some of those and some candy for the kids for Valentine's Day. And then she got me, she gets me the willow, is it called willow tree people? Yes, willow tree people. She gave me one last year, and I really, I really love it. And so she got me, oh, I like this one. Oh, this is good. It's called Wisdom. And I like that, and that's pretty. Thank you so much, Miss Barbara. I love that. Where do you get your wisdom from? From God's Word. That's the only place you're going to get it to get, to get through this crazy world and all the negativity, negativity and stuff going on. It's like you got to have that hope in Christ Jesus. So get that from your words. So thank you, Miss Barbara. Beautiful. I'm going to put this in my room. I just went inside, turned out the pool. I'm like, I think I'm going to be done vlogging for the day. I'm like tired. I'm tired. It's five o'clock. Dinner will be done shortly. Hopefully it'll cook kind of quick, but um, we're going to eat. We have a strawberry pretzel dessert, which looks yummy. And then we also have running tonight because we have, I was like, something at my door. No, looks like it. We have activities tonight. So we will be running and doing stuff tonight. So it's been a great day. A great, great day. So thank you for coming along the journey with our family. You have a fantastic rest of your day. Come back tomorrow. We'll do some more stuff. All right, see ya. Bye.